Welcome back. You're with us here on Leaders of Tomorrow and on Bright Sparks tonight. We're featuring two companies for you, Faber Infinite as well as Dropidia Apparels. First up tonight on Bright Sparks, we have a management consultancy startup from Pune that is Faber Infinite. The company focuses on creating unique management strategies for clients and helping them achieve their business goals. Palumi Mukhopadhyay has the story. Big companies have big data, big analytics and big problems. But who comes to their rescue when they need a consultant to guide them? Management consultancy firms. Guys, we have a problem. I have a solution. One such firm that stands out in this sector to identify management centric problems and suggest solutions is Pune based Faber Infinite. Vishal, let's kickstart this interview by starting with the simple question that I have for you. What do you mean by Faber Infinite and why did you name your company as that? Yeah, it's an interesting question basically. The word Faber is a Latin word. The meaning of uh, Faber is craftsman. We truly believe that each organization is different. And so as the challenges and so as the goals they want to achieve. So that's why when we talk about transformation journey of any organization, it has to be crafted, customized to that organization only. And for every organization, the in, in improvement opportunities are infinite. So that's where the word comes, Faber Infinite, which talks about crafting infinite growth opportunities. Basically, Faber Infinite is a management consultancy firm. What kind of training do you provide through this company? For every organization, there are four important pillars which helps them to transform. The first is strategy. The second is operations, that is process improvements. Third is basically the development of new product or services, which is through innovation domain. And fourth is a people development. So we cater to the organization in developing in all those four aspects. All right. So other than core skills, what kind of other soft skills are needed for employees to contribute for an organization's transformation? Only one word that comes to my mind is called ownership. And that's where we always say that ownership comes with accountability as well as responsibility. So one has to be responsible as well as the accountable for the task. So whether you talk about the top management or bottom management, we say, always say that chairman to the doorman concept. If from chairman to the doorman, everyone takes the ownership of the task that they are doing, the entire team will transform the organization in shortest possible time. So give us an idea about the USP of your firm. How is your company different from all other consultancy firms in the same space? The differentiator for uh, uh, by Faber Infinite is we assure the results. We guarantee the results. And that's what the clients are looking. When they are investing in a consultant, they are looking for some return on investment. Where we are giving more than 10 times return on investment for many of our, all of our clients, in fact. And that's something which separates us from the entire crowd. And we proudly say that we are not a white collar consultant, but we are a blue collar consultant. Faber Infinite supports companies to implement and sustain practices for focused operational. Within just three and a half years of operations, Faber Infinite has been successful in bagging clients from over six different countries globally. It's been successful in fetching compliments from selected Fortune 500 organizations of the world as well. So when it comes to Faber Infinite, what kind of services do you provide in different sectors? Our services and offerings are industry neutral. So you name it and we work with that sector. Uh, we are working in engineering sector. We work with uh, pharmaceutical companies. We work with plastic companies, chemical companies. Uh, logistic companies. Apart from that, we do work with certain governments in Africa and we are one of the few consultants who, who is also into uh, kind of farming and horticulture industry. And one of our offbeat client is also one of the cricket board where we help them to uh, kind of streamlining their processes. So you spoke about Africa. Since you cater to both domestic and international market, what kind of stark differences do you notice in both the worlds? Uh, the first thing comes to my mind is uh, decision-making process. Uh, in India, it is comparatively slower and even for the smallest decision, we take a longer time. Where in Africa and Middle East, there are only two answers, yes or no. So decision-making is much faster. So let's shift focus and talk about Skill India movement. So what kind of contribution is Faber Infinite making when it comes to the campaign? Definitely Skill India movement and Make in India movement is very crucial for India's economic growth. But at the same time, we can only uh, make in India and export it outside if we produce a good quality. 
and for that you require certain skill set which is many time it is lacking and that's where we come into the picture and we also train people into their own regional languages so that they can learn faster. Catering to companies from numerous sectors like manufacturing, process industry, healthcare, hospitality, farms and many others, Faber Infinite has become a noted blue collared consultancy firm in India. Proposal is done. Okay, all arrangements are done, you can leave for cancer. Okay.